It's Wednesday time for our weekly trip up to the new zoo. Neil Anderson joins us live this morning from Swamico with the giraffes. Hi, Neil. Hey, good morning. And we're with the giraffes, and they're getting ready to go outside. Uh, they'll probably Hi, go outside guys. as soon as the temperature turns about 45 degrees. But you can see this is Zuri right here, and this is Hodari. Now, Hodari, he turned six in February. Wow. Um, Zuri will turn six now in August. But we're going to talk a little bit about animal lifespans, okay? It really all has to do with the heart. Inside here, inside this chest here, you've got a heart the size of a basketball. It's huge. But here's the deal. You're going to take a, if you've got a piece of paper and a pen or a pencil, write this number down. Okay, you're going to like this. 800 million. Now think about this, okay? When the great clock of life was wound up for all these animals, they get 800 million heartbeats. Mm. Okay? So if you do the math on these guys, you know, uh, you take some animal like, say, the, uh, oh, the, the Lee shrew, one of the smallest, the pygmy shrew, one of the smallest animals in the world. Okay, its heartbeat is about 1,400 beats a minute. Mm -hmm. Only weighs a quarter of an ounce, okay? And it lives for about a year and a half, okay? These guys, if you do the math with that, they've got a heartbeat of a rate, oh, roughly around 50 beats a minute. And that gives them a lifespan of about 30 years. Interesting. Okay, and then if you do this, you work this like, say, even with elephants. Elephants, you know, they have Oh, a heartbeat, oh, roughly about 30 beats a minute. A little bit slower than the giraffes, okay? And they, but then that makes them live a little bit longer too, and they live to about 50 years old. So you can just, and this works with all the mammals, okay? You can work this all out with mammals, except it doesn't work with us. And the reason it doesn't work with us is because your brain actually supersedes the heart uh, with humans. So you can't work that figure out. But it's a lot of fun playing with that figure and taking a look at lifespans because if you take a look up and say you Google it or whatever, what's the lifespan of an animal, you'll find out exactly what the heart rate of that animal is by using 800 million. That's the magic number. Okay. And of course, you know, uh, if you're uh, taking it easy and living a life that you know, you're you really not too excited like this, you're going to live a little bit longer. Great. Okay, Neil, when we see you next time, will you still be inside or are the, are the giraffes heading outside? Actually, what we'll be, we've got to wait till it's 45 degrees. It's a cool morning today, uh, but we'll be inside. And what we're going to talk about is the oldest giraffe that lived, okay, and why. What was the secret uh, to her success? And you're not going to believe all the ancestors that she has. All right. Okay, thanks, thanks Neil. Neil.